Minister, why has a decision about Novak Djokovic's visa yet to be made, and how long is your government going to let this drag on for? Well, I refer to Minister Hawke's most recent statement, and that position hasn't changed. And there are these are personal ministerial powers able to be exercised by Minister Hawke, and I don't propose to make any further comment at this time. Um, all I will simply say is that the reason we've had since the 15th of December where fully vaccinated eligible visa holders could travel to Australia without needing to apply for a travel exemption um, and to enter those states were allowing them to enter quarantine free, that individual has to show that they're double vaccinated or must provide acceptable proof that they cannot be vaccinated for medical reasons. That is the policy. That policy hasn't changed. That is the policy. And of course, we would be expecting authorities to be implementing the policy of the government when it comes to those matters. These are non-citizens, non-residents. They're visa holders and they may have acquired a visa recently. They may have acquired a visa some time ago and be returning when some of these issues weren't even stamped at the time. And so that's why it's important we have to distinguish between the visa and then the condition to enter the border. They're not one and the same thing and they're often conflated and shouldn't be. They are two things. You can have a visa, just like you can be a citizen or a resident returning, and the condition for you to come in and what happens after that will depend on vaccination status and so on. If you're a citizen or resident, of course you can come back into your own country. If you're not a citizen or resident, then the health rules we have in place to protect our borders and our border protection policies have been central to the government's achievements when it comes and Australia's achievements more generally in having one of the lowest death rates, strongest economies and highest vaccination rates in the world.